Good evening, I'm Tanner Hesterberg along with Chief Meteorologist Shane Smith. We don't typically begin our newscasts in the Sky Alert Weather Center, but this isn't a typical evening, Shane. After we've seen historically low temperatures and record snowfall this week, we could be hit with an even worse storm this weekend. Yeah, this storm definitely has the potential for uh, more big impact. Now, what I mean by that, uh, could see more power outage problems than what we've seen so far. We also have the potential of uh, a little bit more ice with this system than with the last couple. So let's get on over to Pinpoint Alpha Radar and take a look at what's going on right now. The snow is moving into the area. The heaviest of it is down off to our south and west, and it will continue to work northeast over the next couple of hours. You can see London now picking up on a decent snow squall. Same story, Somerset. Little freezing rain or sleet trying to mix in into Williamsburg. Hiding the snow on your doorstep hazard. It'll be here within the next few hours, and then we will see that snow continue to push off to the east, eventually changing to a bit of freezing rain, especially down to the south near the Tennessee border. Winter storm warning in effect through tomorrow afternoon for our western counties, tomorrow evening for our eastern counties, and folks, they have been seeing some pretty big reports of snow out to our west. As this band went through Bowling Green, it dropped a quick inch of snow Saw reports of huge snowflakes on Twitter. Now they're getting a mix of snow and sleet. Now, if we see more sleet here in eastern Kentucky, that will cut down the snow totals a bit. But like I said earlier, I'm a little bit more concerned about our potential of a little bit of freezing rain. Temperatures right now 28, Somerset, Monticello, 26, London, a little cooler off to the north and the east. But as that snow moves in, we're actually going to see the temperatures rise as that warm air off to the south is what's driving this storm system. Now the snow will change over to sleet and freezing rain tomorrow morning. Heavy snow in our northern counties, ice down to the south. The question is how much of each? And folks, the computer models are still a little bit up in the air about how exactly this is going to play out. Right now, our best guess would be snow for most of us tomorrow morning. I think we're a little overdone on the temperatures in future view down around London around 6 o'clock. I think Around 7 or 8 o'clock, we'll probably change that over to freezing rain. Freezing rain will continue to the south for several hours, snow to the north, and then around lunchtime, we'll see a change over to plain rain here in southern Kentucky, up north of I-64 in the Mountain Parkway. They say stay snow a bit longer before changing over to that plain rain. As far as how much snow we're expecting here in southern and eastern Kentucky, one to three inches for most of us, and that's also going to include some sleet accumulation in that. Now we may see just a little bit more over into the Big Sandy, maybe two to four for Pike County, Johnson, Martin, and Lawrence County. Uh, that's something we'll keep a close eye on. Heavier totals off to the north, and then as far as the uh, snow faller, or the ice forecast, I should say, we're going to see a quarter inch to a half inch for a large chunk of the area. That has the potential to cause power outage problems. Also, will create very slick travel conditions tonight and tomorrow night. So overall, the forecast looking very wintry. This is a big impact event. Roads could be in bad shape tomorrow, and we've really got to watch out for those power outages. Also have to watch out for the potential of a little bit of minor flooding, and we'll talk a little bit more about this storm coming up here in a few minutes.